first thought was, wow. <laughs> because a, a, a lot of us spend a decent amount of time, a, a lot of breaking news reporters spend a decent amount of time reporting breaking weather news. And uh, I've felt that, well, I've done that for more than a decade now, uh, there, there were some specifics about meteorology that if I could learn more about them, I could report more thoroughly to my viewers, um, but never felt I really had an opportunity to do that. I mean, uh, it's just extra time, it's extra resources in a variety of ways. It could cost money, it could blah, blah, blah. And I thought, whoa, here's a chance to do this. And some entity that actually cares about journalism wants to make sure it happens. They want to fly people there and have real experts talk about it. It's a, it's a golden opportunity. That, that was my reaction. The National Press Foundation's four-day program on understanding violent weather we brought 19 journalists from across the country to the University of Oklahoma's National Weather Center to learn from the nation's experts in meteorology, forecasting, and weather emergencies. In addition to hearing lectures, the conference served as an opportunity for journalists to meet new colleagues, network, and share ideas with one another. Oh, this has been a heck of an opportunity, um, not only with the excellent speakers that we've had and their willingness to answer what I'm sure to them are very elementary questions, but just having the opportunity to talk with other people within our profession, um, sharing stories, sharing observations and frustrations, um, it really gives you a sense that you know, we're doing the right thing. I think for me, and there's about a half dozen journal, uh, uh, newspaper journalists here, which is the, the kind of circle that I would ordinarily move in, but there's also four to five um, uh, TV meteorologists. And for me, that has been surprising and um, valuable is to be able to talk to those folks uh, to learn the details of what they do. Because we're, we're in similar um, disciplines, uh, print journalism and TV, but I don't think people in my business give them enough credit to know that what they're doing and the science that they're doing and how they're going on TV to explain something to people. And uh, I, I think that bringing those two disciplines or sub-disciplines together has been really valuable. While on the program, the fellows learned about a wide range of weather-related topics, including basic meteorology, forecasting, reporting on different types of weather, working with emergency management officials, and using new media to cover weather emergencies. They also toured the National Weather Center's facilities and the University of Oklahoma's Gaylord College of Journalism and Mass Communication. Upon finishing the four-day curriculum, most journalists agreed that the trip had been interesting, educational, and worth their time. Yeah, definitely. The, the program has, has met and surpassed you know, my expectations and, and the things that I was hoping to get out of it. I'm, I'm coming away with a lot more information and, and excited to get back and use you know, the things that I've learned and talked you know, with some of the experts again. I think that whatever your background, I think that there's something for everybody. And not only am I getting something out of this because I'm newer on the new scale, but for people who've been at this for 25, 30 years, I've been talking to them and they get something out of it as well. So it's not talking over your head. It's challenging enough for somebody like me, but it's in topics that are broad enough for people who, who do this every day. Um, because I don't think that all of these people knew everything. I don't think that there's one know-it-all in the class. I think everybody, when you look around the conference room, everybody was completely engrossed in whoever was talking about whatever weather event that they specialized in. And that's what makes this great, is that it really, really um, can bring in everybody at all, at all skill levels. If you're interested in learning more about this program or others like it, please visit our website at www.nationalpress.org.